Привет всем, guys! I'm so excited about this game. Eternal Evil just released in the full version. I did play this game about a year ago in prologue version, and I was just mind blown. This game was so so freaking good, especially for one developer. I don't know if he hired more developers, but at that time when I played it, it was just one. It was just so freaking amazing. I'm not gonna go to detail what this game is about, you will see it in the very intro of the game, but I know we'll be shooting some ghouls, we will be solving some crazy puzzles, I'm just super pumped. For the sake of this video, I um, made I enabled the shooter mode, which gives me, you know, and uh, machine gun basically with endless rounds just for the sake of the video, so don't die all the time or often. Uh, I am playing and you know, streaming this game, sometimes Saturday or Sunday, maybe in a hardcore mode, so that will be awesome too. What's the problem? I can't tell you over the phone, but I haven't encountered anything like this before. Got it. I'll be at your location in three days. Okay. Thank you. And be careful. Walking Dead style. So that's Hank, right? I believe. Because that's not me. I'm Marcus, I think. Wait! Please! Wait for me! Richards. Detective Hank Richards. We don't have time. You must go across the graveyard and fields towards the farms. There must be fear of these creatures there. Keep the rifle. You are not coming with us? No. I need to find someone at the hotel. Okay, from what I get is uh, I'm Marcos and he was Hank, right? Or is it the other way? Okay, anyway, we got the hotel. Oh, maybe that was me the whole time. And we got the four. So which one do I pick? Complete Hank's storyline after which Marcos' story will start. Okay, so I have to complete Hank's storyline first, which is the hotel. Got it. Um, fantastic. Let's start with Hank. Where are you, Cross? Look at what you've done, you sick son of a bitch! You'll answer for this. I'll get you. Here we go, here we go. Yeah, 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 okay, so I already, I already read this. Flashlight, yeah, hold space bar to tune on the laser aiming. Inventory is a tab, uh, checking the bullets is Q and zoom side, right mouse button. Uh, space bar. Oh, to continue. <laughs> okay, why is this guy not attacking me? Hey, buddy. Uh oh, there we go, there we go. Hang on. I shot you in the head. Once, at least. Die, dude, are you kidding me? How many times? Okay, let's go ahead and go. I got three bullets left, that's not good. Okay, let's see inventory. I am Hank for sure. I have 100 health. Uh, what is it? Okay, that's my MP40 gun. I have a knife and I have help. Got it, got it. Okay. Carefully read the game documents and descriptions of items for successful progress in the plot. Items in the inventory can be combined and rotated in search of secrets. Plot comics can be paused, rewound, and skipped if it has already been viewed. 
In each save room, you can save your progress and pick up items in the chest. All chests are common in all, to all locations, that's probably really important. After being beaten by a vampire, a character loses blood and health changes its state. Green excellent, yellow average, red bad. Food restores the blood supply. There is no pause while reading documents. Okay. Uh, got it, thank you. Okay, so... Let's start reading documents, right? That's what it says. Okay, here are the bullets. 9mm, what is going on here? Where, oh, here's this guy. Anybody else here? Okay, wait a second. Oh, that's a save game. Oh, this is my saves from Prologue game. Holy crap, that's really cool. Okay, let's just go ahead and oversave this. Yeah, I was definitely playing as Marcos last time. Okay, so now it's definitely Hank. We're starting off with Hank. See, that is why it's important to um to replay the game. Even if you play the Prologue, you don't want to load the game again because this is definitely different. Okay, we saved our game. Skip Skull. With this skull, you can skip the puzzle. The number of puzzles of skulls is less than the number of puzzles in the game. Heck with this. No, we sold in every single puzzle. But we know in, ca in case we really can't, we know where it's at. But I'm playing and sewing every single puzzle in this game. I do like the challenge. Okay. Peter Perry? Is that Peter the First? Maybe, maybe not. Doesn't look like him. A guest room, a guest from room 2002 complains about the noise in the walls as if something falls with a heavy sound. A guest found someone's tooth and blood on the floor in the shower stall of room 201. Okay, so 201 looks like we gotta check that room out when we get to it. Anything else here? I don't know a pass. We do not know a pass. Alright, so where do we want to go? We should probably check the downstairs first before we head elsewhere. Yeah, because I don't think... Yeah, this is just going up. So let's go back. Oh, we can run. Fantastic. <laughs> Somebody left uh, a shoe here. Now, what are those sunglasses? Let's take them. No, we can't. That's not fun. Alright, so let's go try this door out. And it does open. Fantastic. Alright, anything here I need to know? Aha, men's. Woman's is locked. Wait, there's somebody there. Shoot, 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 shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so I need to reload a little more often, right? I feel like I shot, basically. Oh, shoot. Jesus Christ. Alright, so I do have a machine gun, right? Let's check this out. Okay, gotta switch with the hotkeys. Bullets. Uh, is this anything for any puzzles? I don't know. Who knows? Wait a minute. Wallets. Acquiring only through playing this game. With this money, you will be able to buy bonuses after early access. Ah! 50 euros. Fantastic. So, collect all the money we can, right? Okay, so there was really nothing here. We're gonna have to go upstairs. I mean, I got, I got some money. That's it. Oh, wait. There are two ways we can go, right? Two stairs? But they connect. Look, they connect. Okay, let's go in the middle. Let's check out the left side first. Yeah, I got my flashlight. Barely works. Um, uh, what about this door here? Let's check this one out first. Hey, buddy. No, nothing. Woo! 
Yeah, this, is, this is a bit easier, yes. Oh my god, this thing scared me. Alright, let's, let's make a little bit more fun, alright? Let's keep it in the gun for now. Ah, what is this? We got a rope, very strong, might be useful. Let's go ahead and collect it. I have a feeling we have to collect it. Uh, Lev Tolstoy. This is Leo Tolstoy, the uh, famous writer of Russia. I don't know, I really don't know who that is, but it looks like him a little bit. Mm, okay, so bullets. There you, here you go again. Another Peter the First. Victor Perry. Aha! I see you. I got this dot, right? Yeah, I can use that as well. Very cool by pressing a space bar. Alright, do we have a map? We do have a map! Oh, that is so cool. Okay, so where the hell are we? Oh, this is where we're at. Okay, what is this red stuff? So these doors must be open. Okay, so... Oh, there's second floor too. Okay, very cool. First floor. Bob, save room. This is where I was, but this door was locked. Oh, that's where we didn't have the keypad. This we didn't have the password for, right? Okay, all right. We got the files. Fantastic. And we got our items. Okay, got it. Uh, let's go ahead and save it, sure. Although I haven't been playing very long. Okay, that's the chest that... All right, so yeah, the chest, um, I can basically put anything in here and next save spot will have exactly the same chest and the item will still be in there according to the notes I read earlier. But our inventory is not full, uh, so we're just going to keep everything in here. Fire gem, we need a fire gem. How do we get a fire gem? Okay, let's see what the map says. Ah, it actually is that. Hang on a second. Let's walk away real quick. <laughs> Aha. So, some kind of fire key. It's actually telling us what uh, the color it is on the map. So, that's really cool. Let's go back and try to go like this down this terrace. See what that is? See where that leads us? Four. Bring it outside. Okay, so we've been here. Let's see. I don't think there was a door in the between them. Yeah, there was. There is one. Hmm. This is blocked off. Can't enter. Okay, let's go ahead. Keep going to the middle, maybe check this side out before we go to the right. So the black ones are probably we don't know if we can access them or not, right? There's room 202. Aha. Oh, those are shotgun shells. Does that mean we'll be well, it does mean that we have a shotgun in this game, right? What else can it mean? Okay, hang on a second. Oh my god! Hey, buddy! Okay, that was really cool. Look at that. <clears throat> this is a pretty violent game, guys, I would say. Okay, let's go this way first. I don't think I'm gonna be able to enter this. It's got like the red symbol, right? The fire gem, yeah. So I don't have that key yet. It is unfortunate. We'll find it. I'm not going through that door yet. And I'm kicking the 
corpse of the ghoul I just or the zombie I just uh, killed. Ah, ah, ah. Water gem? I can go to the basement too, okay. Eh, look at that. Poker room. Black snake, 9mm bullets, fantastic. What else we got here? Anything? You know, I don't see anything. Should not find something in this room? Empty for no reason? I guess it is. Well, I got the bullets from here, right? So let's go back. I guess let's go to the basement. My god! What in the world? What the heck? What the heck? Come and get some. Oh, that was crazy. Birds. We got freaking birds in this game. Unbelievable. So, what does that leave me? What am I? What is my health? Okay, I'm still in green. Uh, 88. So, it's still not too bad. Is that a door? That is a door. Aha! Uh -huh, a chocolate. Restore blood level on 50%. Fan fantastic. <laughs> We're not at 50 yet, so I'm going to save that. I don't want to use it right now. Let's go ahead and save it. More shotgun bullets. No shotgun yet. Yeah. like that sound. Took his face off. Oh man, that's amazing. I'm over here, buddy. Closer. I'm gonna get a shot. I the shots were making them. He moves too much. Now I was making them. So where the hell are we? Hmm, I don't know. We don't have a water key. We don't have the fire jump key. Yeah, so... Okay, so they're red because I, I'm not able to open them. Got it. Okay, that makes sense. That's helpful. I guess I'll head back. This is a big place, but so far I kind of remember where I'm at. Where I was at? This is a bedroom, right? Yeah. Yeah, so let's go all the way back here. And this is the door we can't... We haven't been yet. Aha, uh -huh, what is this? I want to complain about the service at your hotel. My husband and I got a VIP room and expected a special treatment for us, but there was a clump in of hair in the food that was brought to us. This is outrageous and unacceptable. In addition to this, there were not even a bathroom in the room. I have to go somewhere to take a shower. To relieve stress, we asked to bring us something to listen to, and there was no limit to our indignation. When we put the record on, instead of music, we heard the cries of a bird. My husband spent the decent amount of money in your casino, asked you to return the money spent for this room and what my husband lost at the casino. I not about the casino, but maybe the room, right? About the vinyl record added to the documents. The heck. Okay, let's take a look at the files. Okay, so we're just gonna... Collected that document. Very nice. Let's keep going. A 
Live from the other side, figures. Oh, shoot. Oh, there he is. What? He said, what is going on here? <laughs> Shut him his knee. What? Are these guys, you still crawling or what is going on here? Oh my God. Are you kidding me? Oh, I can bend down, cool. My goodness, guys, how are you still alive? Got a knife too. Who could have done this? Like to make a wall in this? Oh, is this TO2? No. This is like the third floor or something. Okay, blood gem. So first. Those supposedly oh, is it like scorpions in here or something? Claw, find the blue billiard ball. It's the biggest than a regular pool ball. Bring it to hunter room and put the compass back in its place in the recreation room. Uh, she said blue, right? Why am I collecting all those? Okay. I need compass. I don't have a compass. don't have a compass. So let's see again. Find the blue billiard ball. It's bigger than regular pool ball. Blue. There isn't blue here. I mean there is, but I don't think I can... That's not the one we can take. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. May contain something. Let's see. Let's go ahead and collect it. Hang on. Examine. Aha! We picked up some kind of sort of key. Fantastic. So we do have a key. A small key. Okay. According to what I have learned, the vampire genes contained in red water are able to multiply the characteristics of any organism. And even modify it. And apparently, <laughs> vampires did not shy away from this and created extremely dangerous fighting creatures. I could use an army of such creatures for my own safety. In my terrariums, there are hundreds of animals and insects of different species, from ants to snakes and bats. I'm afraid I don't have enough red water for all of them. I have to dilute it a lot. It's disaster. Almost all my animals died. I don't understand how this could have happened and why some of them survived. I need to analyze all my recordings, include, including videotapes. I think I figured out what the problem might be. Those animals that received diluted red water died. Apparently there is a saturation point below which red water only kills. In the future, it will be better to focus on several sp specimens than to lose all at once. Looks like I'm starting to get it. One of the scorpions that I brought from China became noticeably larger and more aggressive. He ate the corpses of his brothers. <laughs> from now on, I will call him Arak. I need to be more careful with other animals. I do not know if they are trainable. Arak became too big for this terrarium. I had to move it. I was afraid that he might attack me. But to my surprise, he was calm and even obeyed my commands. It looks like his intelligence has also increased. The shed exoskeleton left by Ar Arach after molting turned out to be quite strong. No doubt when the new ex exoskeleton hardens, it will be bulletproof. The only vulnerable spot will be the head. It's pity that I didn't manage to create at least a dozen of Ar Arachs. Okay, so we got a big spider pile we'll probably have to deal with. Oh my god. Aha. Uh -huh. Single shot grenade launcher. Fantastic. Really? That is so freaking cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on. What slot is this? 
Uh, let's put in the third slot. Okay, is this loaded, I think. So that's probably, if we see a big spider, we have to blow him up like this. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Right now I see small spiders only. Okay. So it looks like we got a first puzzle, guys, here. We don't have a compass that needs to be in here. We don't have a blue ball. The strong one lives in the north. Rage is in the northwest. The tall one lives in the south. That probably has to mean something. I just don't know what at this point. Replica. So that's no use for us. Okay, where's the chest? Where's the safe point at then? No, I missed miss those. I don't see a way anywhere to save this. Which is okay. Locked to some mechanism. Okay. I don't know what to use this for. Oh, is this it now? Some kind of mechanism, right? Yeah, we don't have anything. <clears throat> Looks like it might take a ball though, right? Hang on, maybe at the pool table I wasn't using the right keys. I was using spacebar instead of E, so let me try this again. Yeah, nothing, okay. We got three spots left. Maybe we should drop, drop them off. So let's keep going. It's not full yet. Alright. So we can keep going up. Oh, this is the attic. This is dead end. I see nothing I can take. It's a freaking shovel. God, there's a bunch of spider web. I guess I bet that's where the big spider is, guys. Let's see. What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh my god! <laughs> That's it! That's it! <clears throat> okay, that wasn't too bad with the grenade launcher. We got him right in the head, probably, right? Look at that guy, still freaking twitching. Right, some important he has to be guarded guardian here, right? I wouldn't just put a spider for no reason. Oh, wait a second, I see some blinking. Aha. Uh -huh. Wait, wait, seagulls cry, vinyl record, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and collect it. More bullets. We do see a document about the vinyl record, right? Yeah, there it is. Not exactly sure what it means, but we have to probably play it somewhere. Alright, anything else before I go? Alright, doesn't look like it, so let's go ahead and head back. That thing still scares me when it's dead. Empty bird cage. All 
Right, so that's all blocked off, right? Um, I don't see a place to play vinyl records anywhere. So let's keep going down where we came from. Because there's still a lot more place, I'm assuming, to uh, explore. Look from the other side. Let's go back here. This is where we came from. I think. Have I been here? Mm, I don't want to know. I think so because, you know, this this is red. So that means we tried this office door already. We don't have the key for it. We tried there too, so there's no point of going up. Although right here, here's another space we can try. Maybe the only place we can go, honestly. Maybe that'll take us to room 202. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Let's go. Yeah, that door is definitely locked. Um, yep. And we've already been here, right? Oh, okay. That's a freaking bird, that shot. Okay, what's next? So we've been there. Um, we've been to that door right down there as well. Alright, so should we go? Yeah, let's go down to this door first. Before we go up. Yeah, or this door. Shit, shit, shit! Get away from me! Where did he come? Where the hell did he come from? What? He freaking crawl. He's a crawler. That is crazy. Oh my god. Okay, 34. So that means we can go ahead and eat this chocolate bar, right? Oh, 74. Fantastic. Bastard. I can't believe it. It'll be a hard game to kill this guy with a pistol, you know? So this game is tough. Oh, I haven't been here yet. Game okay, music changed. Now, what the hell are we? What is that? Oh, is that a compass? I bet that's a compass that we need to take. What the? Holy moly! Oh my god. That is a big freaking scorpion. Holy crap. How is this? See Adam. See, it doesn't do anything. Ah, blue ball, blue ball, look at that. Hang on. Let's put it back. Let's take a look at the map. Oh, uh, no, that wasn't even it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's go ahead and pick this up. Collect. We know what to do with this, right? We know what to do with this blue ball. Alright, so let's go down. Because we have not been here yet. But I guess I can explore whatever I can before I wouldn't go back to that pool room. And try to use that blue ball. And I still need a compass for it too, I believe. Which is here somewhere. Oh, it was up. We will find it. Dining VIP room. Maybe Blue Bull will give me somehow a water key, a blue water key. Uh, restore blood level on 100%. This is a very, very, very important tool here. Assuming this is locked. Yeah. Alright. It's gotta be something here. Boy, vinyl player, 
Vinyl player. Get me to it. Great city. Oh, this doesn't do anything. This is a run one. That is unfortunate. I thought it was onto something here. Oh, more money. Yo. Cool. 100 euros. Fantastic. I wonder if it'll let me like play this game again after I beat it. Um, and, you know, to make sure I can collect all the rest of the money. And then when the full game comes out, I use that money to purchase some cool things. Okay, so have we... Do we see everything here? Let me just check the map real quick. Yeah, this is... I mean, we can't get to it. So there's nothing we can do. We have to go back. Alright, one more time. This... I don't know if we can reach it from here. It's behind this wall. And to get there, there's no door here, right? Yeah, there's no way. Ah, oh, I bet it's through this door, and then there's a the stairs that goes up to get to the compass. Mm, that sucks. Okay. Well, let's keep going. I'm assuming that's a compass. It looks like a compass from the picture, from a map. There's that crazy zombie. Okay, what the hell is this, right? We have not been here. Really? Hey there. I'm acting like I don't have enough bullets. Anybody else? The heck? The heck is going on? I guess it's me if throwing the shell's chairs around. Oh, here we go. Okay, more uh, shotgun shells. I haven't found any shotguns yet. But I will. Fire gem. No, we don't have that. All right, so I can play piano. So there was really nothing in this room. Let's keep going this way. Lock from the other side, of course. Of course it is. All right, let's go back. I think there's only one place we can really go. And have we tried this door yet? We haven't. The hell is this? This is like a bar, a mini bar. Aha. 
Yeah, definitely let's save. It's been a while since the last save, so... And we got the blue ball. So we got one slot left in the inventory. Mm, you know, let's... Let's, um, put the grenade launcher there, because we don't have, um... We don't have enough bullets for that. And keep everything else for now. Oh, boy! Western shotgun, fantastic. Heck yeah. Of course I use that slot again. Alright. Yep, now inventory is full and the water is really, really much needed. So let's go ahead and put one of these waters here. And uh, let's, let's drop the knife in there and pick this guy up. Mm, that gives us one extra slot, that's fine. Alright, now we're cooking. Alright, now we only have one place we haven't went to yet and it's this right here there's two doors i guess let's go to the small ones no we can't it's a water gem that we don't have and get our luggage aha Woo! that guy what did i just take two out with one no there's no way or is there is he alive He's got to be dead, right? Don't waste a bullet on him. Oh, he's crawling. He is still alive. What? Oh, I took his leg out. That shotgun took his leg out. That's why he couldn't walk. That's what happened. Okay, got it. Get my shotgun back. This was awesome. Who's got big balls? Jesus Christ. Christ. One shot. One kill. I like it a lot. I don't have to I don't think I have to aim for the head even. Okay, so we're definitely looking for room 202, right? This is 211. Does no opponents go this way first? Duff. Jesus. You dead? Uh oh. You're alive! Who are you? Detective Hank Richards. I'm looking for Howard Cross, the owner of this hotel. How are you still alive? David told me I'll be safe here and gave me some ammo just in case. David? He was an administrator of the hotel, but disappeared a couple of days ago. Said he needed to grab something and would come back for me. Going crazy here from all the screaming and inhuman growls. Do you know where Cross is? No. I've only seen him a couple of times in all the time I've worked here. What were you doing here? Um, I brought people to the hotel and entertained them. I haven't seen a single happy face here. I can't stay here any longer. I don't have food and... I can't evacuate you now. If you sneak, they might not notice you. Go barefoot. Get to the farms. There, you will find other survivors. You got it? I'm scared, but I have no choice. Good luck. I 
I would have took her with me and I was like, hey, just stay behind. She could have helped me shoot. She got a gun. All right. And of course, she left all those goodies behind. So let's see. It's 74. And this one restores how many? How much? The 25. No, it's 50. So I'll still be wasting it. Um, but good thing we have a chest here, right? All right. Let's go ahead. Put that in here. Um, let's do that. Okay. Aha, look at that, we got a blue key now. Fantastic. That opens the specific doors. It's great. Perhaps moving to the city was a mistake. I thought small town were quieter, but the city is the same as my native Saxton. If not worse, despite this, I can't go back. Bespi besides, Jerry's looking out for me here and there. It's better not to even think about it. I've been working on, in a newly opened hotel for more than a month. Jared said that they would pay me more here and I would have my own room where I can leave. The main thing is li to listen to Mr. Cross and not ask unnecessary questions, although this place is much better than the old host hostel. Some things here are very questionable. I'm used to seeing a client off and seeing him leave, but here they told me to leave the client alone in the room after I've done my job. During my time at the hotel, I have never seen any of my clients leave or return to me for a second time. Also, from time to time, there is a rumble, as if something heavy is being dumped down the garbage chute. Maybe it's because the hotel is still under construction, but no work is being done in this part of the hotel. If you don't pay attention to these things, it seems that my life has started to get better. David promised me we would run away from this hotel together, move to another city, and he would take care of me. Okay, maybe she's kind of she was kind of some kind of nurse or something, right? He's so stupid and na naive. He thinks that somewhere there will be better. I used to think so too, but no one can escape their fate. David doesn't think so. He said that he had done bad things, but now he will try to do better and atone for his guilt. I don't know what he meant by that. I don't know how to describe the nightmare happening around me as if I was in the house of horrors. I tried to escape from a hotel, but I saw a snake in the hallway. A damn huge snake. I chased me. I managed to get into my room and close the door. I constantly hear no someone's footsteps behind the door. David left me a gun. I do not know what to do with it. I thought many times about putting a bullet in my head and ending it. Because there is no way out anyway. But something stops me. My life hasn't been peachy, but damn it, I want to leave. Maybe that idiot David influenced me so much that I began to believe in a better future for myself. I need to endure this nightmare and believe that somehow there will definitely be a way out. All right. So that was the lady I just... That was her journal, the lady I just um, met. We got plenty of bullets, so that's good. Go ahead and save. Alright. So I'm inventory slot, I got one left. Let's see. Um oh. I really need anything, I think. So let's just keep it here. I can always come back and drop, drop stuff off. Does it tell me on the map? Yeah, it does where the safe spots are. So that's great. And now we have a blue key, so we can get to, um, probably room 202, right? Alright. What is this? Nothing. I guess let's keep going. The hell? Oh, that's where I shot the snake. Hmm, it's going on this door. So that is not even a door. That's where I came from. 211 is locked. 210 is locked too. 209. Live gem. 207 doesn't open. Okay. I can get here. What about this? Aha. Get out of here. Bonk. Hmm. 
My god. Since the birth of our child, our feelings with Linda became different. She seemed to have grown cold. It's just that it's very hard for both of us right now, but we'll manage. Very useful for me. Why did I save that? Oh, maybe I didn't. Oh yeah, I did save that. VIP room diary. Yeah. Okay, what is this? There's nothing here. Wait, what is this here? Oh, I can't get to it, right? That's unfortunate. What the hell is this? Okay, so let's just go back for now. This is locked. Oh, maybe it's maybe it's on the same level, just a different uh, different way. Yeah. So the only way we can go is back. So this is all locked. We have a blue one. So what if I keep going up? We're here. And the meeting room, right? We have the blue key. So we can open that. is locked. That has to be. We don't have a live gen. Aha! Blue. Right? Where are we? Right here, right? Fantastic. So, we're gonna have that key with us the whole time in my inventory? Okay. Oh, 201. Here's the 202. Okay, something isn't here. Something important. My god! No! Get away from me! Freaking Zambroni! Freaking ankle biter. She was gonna get down. My god. Where's my health? Uh, 34. Yeah, let's go ahead and eat this guy. Much better. Here we go. Aha! Lockpick. Can open simple lock. Great. One slot left. How tired I am of this hotel and loud neighbors, even though I spent only three days in it. The people behind the wall really get on my nerves. I've already gone to them to sort it out. Just shouted at each other through the door. The hotel administration said they will definitely sort it out, but what can they do? This person is lunatic. Alright, so I got a lockpick. Is that it in this room? I thought it was more important than this. Maybe a lockpick is super important. Well, we can read, right? I guess in 202 complains about the noise in the walls. It's something falls with a heavy sound. Okay, that's all we got here. That's how I knew we gotta go to 202. Anything else here I'm missing? Maybe not. So let's check out the adjacent rooms. Wait. Yeah, that's the door I just opened. Lock from the other side. So I can't do use the lockpick on here. Alright. Wait. Ow! You need to check shower cabin. Oh yeah, I remember I was reading something about the shower cabin, right? Okay. Okay, so I just used a lockpick, I believe. Yeah, because it's gone. To open this door. Got it. Anybody here? Alright. Start from the beginning. Give me those bullets.
Yay. So I'm in the shower. I didn't see anything special. Oh, there's a path here. Interesting. All right, anything else here? All right, let's go down the path. Mm, need rope. I do have a rope. Yes. So, where the hell are we now? Oof. I can't, I can't go back up. There's no way I can jump and reach that rope. Oh my god. So much blood. Looks like people were dragged somewhere. Oh, that's what she heard, you know. People were going down this pipe. What the hell is this? Yeah, they were chained up or something. Oh, well, let's go this way first. Shotgun ready. Okay. Okay, so the bodies are in this barrels. Uh, I don't think I should go down there. So this hotel was pretty crazy before this outbreak when it started. They were killing people and doing some, something with them. I think I'm almost out of bullets for the shotgun. I'm not able to reload it. Ah. Now we got the yellow key. Fantastic. Again, some fat bitch we got. Motherfucker, she got stuck in the chute. If I wasn't allowed to have sex with them, I would have left this place a long time ago. And they don't give a fuck what I do with them. The important thing is that the blood is fresh in them. Oh my god, sick ass. I don't know how much longer I can handle it. To guard here, of course, I've killed quite a few people before, but e even I'm already s already sick of this, buddies, my, my hobby has become a routine. I really want to take a fucking break and not touch anyone, no more seeing unconscious bodies at all. There is no pleasure from so many fucking bodies, it's not fun anymore when you don't see their pain. It's a sick game. oh. Well, this is just the money. I have to have an inventory slot to pick them up. Okay. Put this in there. And uh, that's it for now. Oh, 400 euros. Fantastic. But see, it didn't want to take this. I have to have an open slot. Uh, I don't think that should be the case. I should fix that. this yeah we have the orange key now what happened here seems unreal is but it's all true I am not drunk I've been sober for two years and I haven't had taken a drop in my mouth. Yesterday, September 14th, it's about 5 o'clock in the afternoon, strange things begin to happen to people. Several people suddenly collapsed to the ground. I tried to help one of them, 
something strange has happened to his body. His arms seemed to have grown. After a while, several people got up and looked very sleepy. Suddenly, a woman attacked me. I pushed her away with my foot. Then I saw some people throwing themselves at others and eating them. I ran away. For several hours, I hid in the pharmacy's back room. Then they told me on the radio to go to the hotel. Here I met a few more survivors, but crazy ones turned out to be much more. This place is not safe at all. We had to find a hideout, so we ended up in the cellar. We blocked the entrance with cabinets. There was no one here, and fortunately, there was food. Only there is no water. Instead, there is wine and other alcohol. Apparently, it's my destiny to die drunk. Damn, Judy died. Those damn rats ate her and bit us. We were fighting the moth all night. There must be hundreds, if not thousands of them here, but it better fight than those monsters. It turns out these barrels are filled with lamp oil. It's very dangerous if such lamp falls and a fire starts. Okay, we got rats. I probably should use machine gun for this, right? Look at those crazy looking rats. Are you kidding me? Okay. Oh shit. Is that it? This guy dead. It is now. Crazy. Oh my god. Freaking ankle biters. Alright, anybody else? Rats. I think that's it. It would not be fun. It would not be fun shooting the rest of the shotgun. This guy dead. What's my life to? 62. Okay, I'm still okay. Get a couple more bites. I'll use my candy bar I got. Mother Mary, help me. Okay, so they drink all these wines. <laughs> Do you guys know if wine, why wine is turned, uh, the bottle is always in wineries, is always, you know, sideways, not up? The bottle is um, turned sideways, it lasts longer. Do I need to burn this place? Is this what I need to do? That's the oil, right? That's the lamp oil. I think I need to burn this place somehow. I said my game recently, I think I have. Anything else I need to turn here? Here's another one. Mm, am I missing a few? Okay, 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 so this is what I missed. Okay, so I was able to push this out. Son of a god, no, 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 no. So, I think one more push, I'm assuming. Why is this, why did this stop? That's what my question is. Why did that stop? I was not supposed to burn something. Who knows? Just keep going.
Okay, so I found a door. I hear some knocking. I thought I was supposed to burn this place somehow. This all this things clogged. I don't know. Maybe that's how I get rid of my miles if instead of shooting them. Who knows? Too late now. So I got uh, more bullets for my shotgun. Wait, have I been here? Yeah, I have been here. This door was just locked. I see. This door was just locked. didn't go this way but now I believe I can so let's go check this out the big freaking place guys mm, no I can't it's like from the other side okay have I been there yes I have where did it take me yeah I have been there right that's like a little mini bar. So, I think where I haven't been here yet is this door here. Maybe I already have. Yeah, it's blue, so yeah, I have. So wait, where do we need to go, honestly? Uh, we need to get this compass somehow, right? Yeah, meeting room, let's go there. And maybe we can go straight and get to it. Yeah, 2 one, two, oh, two. Lock from the other side, are you kidding me? Okay, so I know we have that pool room uh, puzzle. <coughs> what the crap? Are you effing kidding me? Son of a gun! My god! Are you kidding me? Alright, let's try this bad boy again. <laughs> Another bullet for this uh, grenade, uh, grenade launcher again. So I picked it back up, and hopefully I can blow him up with this pretty quickly. If not, that's not good. Um. I'm not a weak human. You're a weak vampire, I'll prove it to you. The hell did you go? Oh shit, this is not good. What the hell is he? Where the hell is he? How's my, how's my life? 53. Let's go ahead and chew this. While we can. Um, where is he? Oh, he's right there. Right? Is that him right there? Is he stuck? Yeah, I think he's stuck. I don't know if I'm hurting him or not. Probably not. Maybe I'll try to get him from the top somewhere.
Ah. So he's glitching. Which I'm hoping to use it. Um, right there. I think I'm hitting him. Yeah, I mean, I'm hitting him. Gosh, he's like, how long would it take me to kill him like that? With if, well, if he didn't glitch. Oh my god, okay. That would have been a brutal fight. But yeah, haha, <laughs> got him. There he is. Um, sorry though, right? He's in the stairs. <laughs> he glitched on the stairs. Oh man, that's that's my luck, I guess. Okay. So that means we can go ahead and keep, keep going this way. Oh man, that was good. That was really good. All right, well, that bazooka really would uh, help me out wherever I, I just got I just got really lucky with that guy. Must be Howard's office. All right, Howard's office. Uh, let's see, <laughs> my health is great. Um, there's no safe place. Okay. There's a bit of a safe place in here. Seems like he really loved his daughter. Alright, show transcription, which is not working. Okay. Let's just try to read it like this. I hope this November trip to Spain will help us get away from the nightmare we have experienced. We need to think less about what happened to Sarah. For a while sitting on the train, Emily was still very quiet. I didn't know what to talk about to her about. Suddenly she asked me why these months of the year are called that. I told her about the Roman calendar and where the names of the months came from. Emily listened very carefully and then asked about the names of the days of the week, their origin. Her curiosity helped us kill a couple of hours on the way. We went to the parade. It seemed that on this day Emily smiled for the first time since the death of her mother. At the same time, there was still sadness in her eyes. It will take a lot of time for this sadness to pass. Last year's trip was a breath of fresh air. This year, we are going to the opposite direction, to a country where the memory of dragons is honored. During the fight, Emily suddenly remembered that this was the month of the first Roman Emperor. She became curious about what the month are called where we are going, walking in the mountains, Emily was beaten by a viper. The locals, looking at the bite, immediately understood what was going on and helped us get to the hospital. It was hard for me to look at her. I would have done anything to save her. After her recover, Emily began to read about snakes and then about other dangerous animals. Surprisingly, instead of being scared, she became interested in them. She even wanted to install terrarium at home. This trip's brought us much closer together. I'll try not to forget about them. People of the city don't deserve a good life. First, they took away my love, Christine, for that the main perpetrators paid with their lives despite their efforts to escape the punishment. Then they took away my life from me, my daughter, Emily. I have nothing left in this world, in this damn world. Evil rules the earth and this evil is in humans. They killed their own neighbors for the most for any reasons, corruption consumes those who will power. Society has rot to its core. It doesn't matter anymore who killed Emily, they are all responsible for allowing such atrocity and will all face retribution. Awful. Our mission is coming to an end. Sifar is pleased with my work. He revealed to me the name of my daughter's murderer, Detective Hank Richards. I should have guessed. This explains why it was taking so long for the police to solve my daughter's case. Sifar assured you will bring me Richards, dead or alive. Saying this, Sifar's eyes lit up while talking about it. Seems like even the ring on his forefingers has sparked for the first of thirst of blood and carnage. I'm going to make this detective suffer. He will feel the pain I left. If it wasn't for him, everything could have been different. That is crazy, okay. I feel like something's fishy about this, right? Okay, looks like we got some kind of instructions to the save. Global save, okay. After a signal, turn the clockwise to desired country, then 
counterclockwise to the next country and again clockwise by 360 degrees. Interesting, okay. November, August 360. Ah, uh, this is it. So, this will be saved in my notes, right? If I need to go back. Um, yeah. Yeah, so we have that. This is sounds like a combination of some sort of save. The Red Dragon, also known as Fire Dragon, in Chinese culture has a symbolic meaning of God of Fire. Marcus, can you hear me? Yeah, I'll be in the city soon. Change of plans. Get to the police station. Find Howard Cross's file that I worked on. I need a proof that I'm not involved in the murder of Cross's daughter, Emily. I think her death started all of this. Okay, so what just happened, right? Did that evil guy wake, wake up and heard my um, conversation and he went to the police station, maybe? That is crazy. Maybe that evil guy is this guy who wrote this letter, I'm assuming. Crazy, crazy. Okay, well, we have still a lot to do, I believe, in this freaking hotel before we go to anywhere else. Uh, let's see, which way? No, let's, let's open this door. So this is, yeah, this is the way we want to go. Right? No, it's not. This is where I came from. Okay. So I definitely know I've been here. But I think something important we need to pick up straight ahead. This blue room. Okay, we got some sort of lighter, uh, but we don't have any space. Okay, is there a save game somewhere? We need to... Oh my god, here's our vinyl player. Aha, uh -huh. about this. Okay. The seagull cried to the inventory. Seagull cry. What happened? What happened to it a second ago? Oh, there it is. Okay, we have to put it here. Did that work? And inserted the record. Not recording. Who knows? What's going on here? A well fed flame will warm the bird's house. Alright, I'm not getting something here, guys. Oh, there's another record. Alright, I really need to uh, find the chest to put all this information in. Mm, yeah, that's. I think that's just the ammo. I can't get my thoughts together what happened yesterday. No one will believe me, but I have to write it down. When I was mourning Emily's death over her body at home, there was a knock on the door. I thought it was the police again with their interrogations, but when I opened the door, two things, two thugs were standing in front of me. I was so taken ba aback by their appearance that I could not object to them when they came into my house and immediately went to the coffin. I followed them to the hall. They were standing over Emily's body when one of them said, Howard Cross, what are you willing to do to get your daughter back? I didn't know what to say. I was ready for anything, but I can't bring her back. So what's the point of this conversation? If you cooperate with us, we'll return Emily to you. How do they know her name? They must have read it in the newspaper. Who are you? I ask you to leave me alone. Only at this moment I noticed the blood was flowing from the hand of one of them and dripping straight into Emily's mouth. What the hell is going on here? I'll call. Calm down. She won't get any worse. 
Be patient, Howard. My heart was beating widely. Nothing happened to for a while, but what do they want from me? And suddenly Emily opened her eyes. She got up and looked at me. I thought I was dreaming at all this. I wanted to hug her. I took a step towards her and had only time to say M when she suddenly rushed me with a wild growl. I jumped back and fell. She was trying to get me with her claws. She had a furious look. I looked up and saw one of the guests put his foot on Emily, pinging her to the floor so that she could not reach me. What did you do to her? Everything that was happening seemed like a nightmare. We brought her do your daughter back to life, Howard. I said it wasn't my daughter. It was some kind of demon. If you do what we tell you, then your daughter will regain her consciousness. I agreed to help them, otherwise I would have lost my daughter again and most likely my life. The hotel renovation is going faster than expected, but it's time to change contractors again, otherwise mm, they might suspect something is wrong with the way this hotel is designed. Maybe we should hire someone from Duxburg this time. The police came in again and asked about missing people. I'm so tired of them, they scare away visitors. I need to remind the chief of police of our agreement to keep his hounds away from my hotel. Okay, something is going on, he did something, something. Mm, useful for bonfire. Yeah, so... I need to find a chest. And basically you upload some stuff to it. And um... Replica. Great. And come back to this room. Let's see. Is there a, Yeah. There's a safe room right next door. Fantastic. This is really convenient. Okay, so what do I want to do? Well, I do want to save the game. Uh, let's drop the shotgun. For now. Um, drop this candy bar. Both of them. And for now it's okay. That's all I want to do right now. Okay, let's go back and see what we can do with the vinyl. I have two vinyls. I bet I have to play one and to record the other one. And be used for recording the sound. Okay, so that one definitely goes in here. This is a blank one. Okay, so let's go ahead and start this record. Okay. Let's put this one in here. Now, maybe we have to record this. Maybe we have to start recording first. Okay. Let's go ahead and start this bad boy. Mm, it's still spinning. Pick up record. Empty vinyl. It's still empty. Mm, that's not cool. Let's try this again somehow. Oh, I can't start. Maybe I do have to play this first. Not working. I don't get it. Okay, so I don't really know. Strange. Is there anything else? What is this? The hell? Having heard the voices of four kinds, the defender will leave his post. Maybe I have to have four vinyls. Nails. Pick this guy up though. Maybe that's not working because I only have one. And I need four.
Yeah, so I, I really don't know. I might have to just come back here. Um, so I can leave this here. It's in some place. Uh, is this one here? Let's just, let's just put it there too. Yeah, let's keep it there. I also don't have to carry it with me. Um, whoa, whoa. No, that's not a vinyl. <laughs> so down there. Have we been down there yet? No, we weren't able to, we were never able to open this door. Till now. What? How can I rotate it without shooting? After the signal turned clockwise to the desired country, what the what country? Hmm. She became curious about what the month are called, where we are going. Interesting. Okay, so after the signal turned clockwise to the desired country, then counterclockwise to the next country, and again clockwise by 360 degrees. Who freaking knows? Okay, so I think I got the I think we're on the where the click is. I just I, I just got to a click, so um let's go this way. Okay, I heard a click. So now that 360 this way. No. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Very cool. Money. Okay, so we got another vinyl record. Fantastic. So we didn't need to know any countries. You know, I just kind of follow, you know, to the right till it clicked again. And then, I mean, to the left till it clicked, then to the right till it clicked, then. Oh! <gasps> No, that a big boy. You dead? That would be dead. I want to make sure you're dead. Aha! How convenient. Try to get to me. Okay, so we now have two vitals, but I think we need like what did it say? Four or something or three? Who knows? I wish you could just drop items. Okay, this is the vinyl, yes. Um, let's try to put this one in. Mm, I bet I, I have to, what I have to do is Seagull cry, add it to the in inventory. Okay. Okay, where did I find that at? It doesn't, it wouldn't tell me, right? But I got two vinyls already. Maybe I just need to keep playing them. I don't know. With this, you can record sounds. Yeah. So hang on a second. Four kinds. So we only got two. We need two more vinyls somewhere. Who knows where? But we're on the right track, I believe. So at least I can put the vinyl to rest. For now. Oh, I can't. Hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, just move that over. How's my health? 93. Okay, I'll just kind of keep walking with that bar. Yeah. Got two open slots. Can I just drop stuff? I don't think I can. That sucks. Okay, so... Oh, 
just happened. I don't like that noise. Okay, so we're over here. Okay, because we haven't solved this puzzle yet, right? We have not solved this puzzle yet. Uh, we just solved this puzzle here somewhere, and I think that thing disappeared. So, we gotta go here somehow. At least. We don't have the green key yet. Alright guys, so we do still have a lot of work to do. Uh, I'm gonna save that for far part 2. And um, I will see you guys really soon, okay? Make sure you guys click subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications so you guys don't miss the second video.